I have to leave first thing in the morning. Mm. You want to spend the night? <laughs> You're such a pastor. <laughs> first thing in the morning, I meant. Mm. How about second? There hasn't been any scenes that have ever kind of actually zeroed in on, you know, what is it between you two? Linnell and John are continuing their, you know, their, their sort of romance and their sort of business relationship. Time's breakfast. John? Uh, a little later this morning. Understood. I'll see you in, yeah. I, you know, you get to see a lot of these characters spend some, some really like quality time together that you haven't seen yet. Get back in. <laughs> Luke and I really root for these characters, and so I think you know to see the scripts come in and 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 for them to be happy is, you know. Such a relief. <laughs> We're happy to. I'm having a hard time thinking past right now. This isn't real. We can't live like this forever. There's no such thing as forever, baby. All we can do is live like there's no tomorrow, because one day we'll be right. I think it's a dream come true for Casey to have you know, his woman by his side, out in nature, kind of living this lifestyle that he grew up with and that he loves and is part of his legacy, you know, and to have her kind of accept it and, and, and want to be there for it and actually fall in love with it too, I think it's just, he's over the moon. Saddle Bronc rider and gold card member Tom Reeves. He'll be one of our judges tonight. I guess everyone thinks I'm the dumbest man in the valley. You can hold her damn hand, Rip. Beth is starting to find someone that she cares about. There's a lovely scene where Rip is making Beth breakfast after she's turned up with a bottle of whiskey and doing shots and just being Beth. You know, she knows how to do that. <laughs> she's good at that, though. <laughs> <laughs> but she doesn't know how to be vulnerable in a T-shirt and no makeup and walking downstairs and someone being nice to her. Like, what the fuck is that? She's just amazing, you know? And, and so there's this one moment where she's, I make her breakfast and, and I set it down and she's eating it and I'm staring at her and it's, you know, a, a bit uncomfortable when you're eating breakfast and somebody's staring at you, but it's very lovingly and she just starts getting emotional. And we both are just are staring at it and we're just talking with our eyes and it's beautiful. Seeing like that, it, you know, especially her and I, for some reason, we just kind of get lost in each other. 